guys I am back with another video and today I am going to talk about this little baby right here so if you're interested then just keep watching okay so this is the Michael Kors Empire logo Myla Micro the all these names it's just they're, they're so long so it's the Empire let's just look Empire logo Myla Micro crossbody and crossbody <laughs> you can do the crossbody I'm gonna let you see how it looks on somebody my size but anyway I'm gonna talk about uh, this little baby how cute she is and I'm gonna talk about some things that you can fit in her so let's just kind of start off with the good stuff this is so cute I was in Macy's and I saw this I've been eyeballing this uh, particular bag I'm not sure if you know it or not but this comes in the micro it also comes in small and it also comes in the medium I've been uh, actually eyeballing the small for the longest time it has like a leopard print or a leopard fur or whatever. I think it's on sale at Bloomingdale's, so I'm not sure. I'm, I'm kind of interested in it. But this is so stinking cute. I was with my husband when I saw it. And I was like, oh my God, look at this. And so I, was, I took a closer look. I was like, mm, it can only work as a wallet. And he was like, you think? But you can fit a little bit of you know you can fit some things in here so anyway as you can see it's got that uh, traditional type of um, what canvas type of material that they have on their bags and here lately he's uh, they changed the print so it's got like the the different kind of I don't know uh, the logo the little Michael Kors logos and as you can see it's got the buckle on the front and this is uh, purely for aesthetic purposes it's not functional it's just a little lock I had someone comment on a video of mine and it was like how stupid is it to have a, a lock on a, a purse like that that you can't do anything with and I'm, I'm, I'm like okay that's the style of the purse it's not a functional lock it's just for aesthetic purposes just to look at so anyway um, it does have a strap so with the strap you can detach it so in theory you can use it as a wallet so you can just take these off the only thing is it'll show the little gold clasp right here which is totally fine as far as the hardware is concerned it feels uh, pretty consistent with the um, I think it was the mini Williamsburg uh, bag that I did a review on. I'll try to link it up above, but the the hardware, uh, it just feels a little bit lighter. And it could be it's because it's a micro bag. I'm not sure. Um, of course, this is something if you're going to wear it as a bag, you can't fit. You cannot fit your phone in it. They do have those razor phones that are out now. I'm not sure if that would fit in the bag, probably not. But I was talking to my daughter about, she has a, a little purse and and I saw her one day, she was getting ready to go to work and she had a stuff ca to capacity and she had her phone in her hand. I said, well, you don't have enough room for your phone. She said, I don't put my phone in my purse, I put it in my pocket. And I was like, is that a thing? I didn't even know that was a thing. And so until I started looking at other videos of how other people carry of course these were younger ladies I'm thinking maybe younger ladies just carry their <laughs> I don't know I mean I know that's crazy to say but I I've always carried my phone in my purse but she says she's always she never puts it in her bag she always has it either in her hand or in her pocket so um, yeah your phone cannot fit at all so if you're one of those folks that you have a little you you don't mind doing that you can definitely carry this as a crossbody another comment that I saw on Macy that Macy said just kind of tickled me to death um, somebody you know how you can rate a product so they rated it as a one and they said this purse is so little it's like for a kid or it's maybe for a micro poodle or a little poodle or maybe dog you know and I'm thinking it says micro on <laughs> <laughs> I'm like micro if you look at the if you read you know just read the read the the, uh, the description of the bag why when you buy the bag you thinking it's gonna be bigger than the description of the bag I don't know that that always baffles me a little bit so anyway it's super cute now let me just tell you all what you actually can get in it okay so um, you can get some um, hand sanitizer right and I'll probably I don't know if I'm gonna do a double screen or if I'll switch to another screen but you can get 
hand sanitizer. I have like a Fenty chapstick that you can get in there. Um, I always tend to have headaches or some type of pain, so I'm always going to carry some type of BC powder. Okay, so you have that. And on the outside of it, uh, you can have your, you can fit your cash. You can put your cash out there. Now, I don't know, it, it, the, the little pocket for your cash, it is tight, so I don't think that it would fall out or anything. Um, if you think that it would fall out, you could just probably put something else in it to just kind of make the pocket uh for it to fit a little bit more snug in the pocket. So anyway, I got my keys and a credit card. Okay, and then that's about it. That That's all that you're gonna get out of this bag. But she is so, so cute. I know this is really a quick video. I need to look and see what this material is made out of. I'm gonna look, look at my phone real fast. Um, I don't know if it's leather or not. I know sometimes some of his bags, are leather and sometimes they're not um, adjustable strap now I don't know how they think this is adjustable this is a micro bag this is this bag is not that's not adjustable at all so um, it does have a snap closure I forgot to tell you all about that or show you all that but yeah and it snaps pretty good it's not a type of snap that you have to fight with some some either don't snap or you have to fight with it. Let's see, and the dimensions are five and one fourth in width, three inches in height, and one and three fourths in uh, the depth. So that, that tells you right there that this purse, that this bag is like microscopic. It doesn't, I'm assuming, I don't know what this material, the brown part is. It's not leather, it says, PVC, polyester, cotton, lining, polyester trim. Oh, it does say the trim is leather. So this part is uh, leather. So anyway, what else about this bag? I think that's pretty much it. So uh, it did, if you go to Macy's right now, like as we speak right now, <laughs> it's on sale for 118 and uh, they have brown luggage and then they have this color and I'm thinking like when you go in the store they only had two in the store so I don't know if if they're gonna get any more in as far as this size but if you're interested definitely go now um, I think I might order the the small one because I do think this is so cute the big one uh, I don't know about the the medium one I think that's probably a little bit too big but the small one but I think this is so cute this is really cute so anyway I'm just gonna do, uh, give you all some demo shots and let you see what it looks like on my body frame and then that'll be it let me know down in the comments if you would you, what do you think about this purse do you wear micro purses are you looking at me like girl are you serious or are these your thing I think this would be cool if you were going out and like to a concert or something like that something you but it you needed it to be really small and you didn't want to carry a big bag and you needed something micro I think this would be so adorable so anyway make sure you check out how this looks uh, on my body frame and you all already know how big I am so I'm gonna let you see that and that'll be it thanks so much for tuning in and until my next video switches